County Public Schools vaccine rollout. As you well know, we are so thankful that the governor has basically given the authorization for educators to be vaccinated starting this upcoming Monday, March 8th. This decision has been critical to our decision to reopen. So we're very grateful, very grateful that now educators are in a position to receive the vaccine. The district has entered into an MOU, we call that a memorandum of understanding with the Clayton County Fire and Emergency Management Office Department. We have finalized that MOU and we are prepared, preparing or prepared to administer the COVID-19 vaccine. The district is expanding its partnership with the company ID Tech Molecular Laboratories it's an African-American owned molecular laboratory to provide quick turnaround test, testing for employees and students. I want all of you to know that while we do not require everyone to take the test, we will have testing available for all of those students and employees that would like and need to take the test. We encourage all of you, as you see the need, as you experience symptoms, we need you to take full advantage of the testing that's available. Please know that our maintenance department has refurbished the North Jonesboro Center to ensure that we meet all compliance so that we can have a secure vaccination location. Remember, that location is right here in the central office complex. Our nurses here in Clayton County they have completed the required training and observations with the Clayton County Health District to support the vaccine site. Our technology department has developed an employee vaccine registration appointment portal to manage scheduling and all employees will access that in the portal, in, in the employee portal. Employees, you should get a communication by end of day Wednesday about the vaccination procedure and sign up process. I encourage all of you, while I can't make any of you, nor would I want to make any of you grown people take the vaccine, I'm encouraging all of us, all of us, to take full advantage of the opportunity to get the vaccine. Staff will be able to access the scheduler through rapid identity, as I already, already shared, using the employee portal. Remember, it's in the employee portal. Vaccines are slated to be administered starting March 8th. Again, non-mandatory testing. However, employees are encouraged to be vaccinated. Now, we will start with a few priority groups, but that will be communicated in the email. But as soon, as soon as you get the communication, I know you must discuss the vaccination uh, with your family members and your loved ones, but we need you to, to have those discussions, make your decisions quickly, and sign up quickly. The clinic operation hours will be Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 8 to 5 p.m., Tuesday and Thursday, 8 to 7 p.m., Saturdays in March, 9 to 2 p.m., and two Saturdays a month in April and in May. Our goal is to inoculate between 100 and 150 staff members daily. We're going to also coordinate a drive through event the first Saturday the vaccine becomes available. So more details to be announced. But a part of our reopening plan is to assure we mitigate with testing being available for those who need to be tested and that we participate in the administration of the vaccine. We're encouraging everyone to take the vaccine. 